Hi, it is Kitty Blue. Um, I have a box to open today. It is October um, 19th. And um, in my last box opening, I actually said that I had no dolls on order. Um, but I lied, I guess. <laughs> or I forgot. Um, this is my doll chateau order. It's a Zan Zanith. I may be saying that wrong. It's um, X A N T H E. Just gonna try and sorry. I'm trying to work with the lights here. There we go. And um, I got her in the green color, the green resin, and uh, she is like a elf fairy kind of doll. I'm excited to see, to see what she looks like in person. Hmm. Usually there's a thing in here. Alright. Should have grabbed my other scissors. Oh! Haha. -ha. Might be more effective, maybe. Um, so yeah, after this box opening, I will not have any dolls on order, although I'm still um, thinking about getting the Soul Doll Spider version of Junya. Um, just haven't decided, and if I do get her, I haven't decided on like what color to uh, get her in. Oh, awesome. Okay. It's a little duck bag. Let's see what is in here. Sponge. Ha ha. A little uh, little shrimp sticks or something. <laughs> another rubber ducky. I'm not sure why, but he sent me another rubber ducky. And some gloves. Oh, how cool. Oh, awesome. They actually sent me a wig cap, which is always handy. And it's a little uh, pinwheel. That's kind of cool. <laughs> it's cute. And then I have this wig, which um, not exactly sure where this came from, but it is really long. It's really pretty. It must be just something that they decided to uh, give away with her, but it's a really long, gorgeous auburn wig. So maybe it'll actually fit her. Alright. So here is the certificate. And nope, no doggy sidekick for the video today. <laughs> he is shut out of the room. Alright. What is this? Oh, okay. There's uh, the eyeballs in here and her little antennas. Hey, this is so exciting. Yum. I'm like excited to see what this green color looks like. Well, obviously you can kind of see what it looks like in this. So I'm sure it'll be the same color. Oh, she's so Cross fingers, her wings are nothing that's broke. Oh wow, her body is like much thicker than I thought. She's gorgeous. Oh, this is so cool. Hee <laughs> hee. My camera's not picking her color up very well. It looks very pale, at least from my point of view, in the viewfinder. 
such tiny little feet. Her legs are so short. So this is her torso. She's like much thicker than um, their, their normal MSDs. Um, this is just a, like almost solid, I guess you could probably, no, no, no. This isn't really very functional. I'm not sure why it's, two pieces here. But it's pretty cool. Her arms are very flexible. Squeaky as they usually oh so pretty. <gasps> so cool. Oh my gosh. That is the back of her. She's got four little tiny little cute wings. Um, let me get her little antennas out. I need to put her eyes in, but, um, oh, I should have just gotten her with her face up. I'm, I always do that. I'm just like, well, maybe if I, I'll save some money by not getting her face up, but I never end up, <laughs> it, I always end up, like, waiting forever to have somebody do it or to try and do it myself. There we go. There's her little antennas. She's so cool. Her green color is very pretty. I'll have to try and like do a photo comparison with this green color compared to like Resin Soul. Um, yeah, this torso, it doesn't bend back any further. It does, she can kind of scrunch forward. Um, her head can tilt backwards, although it looks very, oh, although it looks very awkward for her to be bending her head like that. The wings can kind of mainly just up and down. They don't want to stay out too far this way. Squeak, squeak. This is always weird to me when I um, get a doll that's these ball joints here are just so overly huge, more than necessary than they need to be. Um, I got my doll more Ilya, and and they have these big, huge ball joints here that. Or, well, in fact, just ridiculously big, and I just don't feel very necessary. Um, I think they could have gotten away with doing something different in this area. But, you know, most of the times, you know, most of my dolls will have clothes on. Um, or I should say all my dolls usually have clothes on, so I don't think that's going to be really too much of an issue. Um, I do have this purple wig that I was, like, thinking about using for her. Let's see if I can just slide that on. I think I might need to put that wave cap on first. But it could look kind of cool if I can get it on her properly with uh, the wave cap. So there she is, uh, the uh, Doll Chateau uh, Xanath. That's the way I'm going to pronounce it. And uh, that is it for the box opening for today. Or who knows, you know, I may find another secondhand doll, or uh, if I order this old doll. So off she flies. Thanks for watching. Bye.